Can People's Republic of China Invade the Philippines? According to a former top Philippines defense official, the Philippines should prepare to be invaded by China. However, it's not clear whether the warning was prompted by genuine fears of Chinese aggression or Filipino domestic politics. Within hours, the Chinese can destroy most of the country's defense facilities and probably some of our cities, former Secretary of National Defense and National Security Advisor Norberto Gonzalez told. There is no doubt that China could militarily defeat the Philippines. The impetus for the warnings of a Chinese invasion seems to be political. Gonzalez urged the Philippine government to devise a contingency plan against a Chinese attack. China does not have a history of invading other countries, but it is not averse to using military might to settle territorial conflicts, he said. Gonzalez's warning came at the same time as a Philippine senator expressed concern about the sinking of a Filipino fishing boat in the West Philippine Sea by a Chinese vessel has created a sticky public relations situation for the government of President Rodrigo Duterte. China's increasing assertiveness in the contested sea lanes has emboldened Chinese fishing boats to virtually throw their weight around in the fishing grounds and the Chinese government has abetted it. The situation could become more and more incendiary. The Philippines isn't the only nation that fears war with China, which is also embroiled in a dispute with Vietnam, Taiwan, Singapore, Malaysia and Indonesia over sovereignty of the South China Sea. Beijing has been fortifying islands in that sea zone, adding airfields and anti-ship missiles. It has also seized control of the Scarborough Shoal fishing ground that Manila claims as part of its territorial waters. Gonzalez also suspects that China will be forced to use the military option after apparently seeing that there are no other means to extend the term of President Rodrigo Duterte. The thought that China would risk war with the United States, which has had a mutual defense treaty with the Philippines since 1951, to keep a Filipino president in power seems unlikely. Though the US left Subic Bay and its other bases in the Philippines during the 1990s, American advisors and weapons have sustained Manila's perpetual fight against communist and Muslim rebels. More important. The U.S. has recently been upgrading the Filipino military's own bases as part of the 2014 Enhanced Defense Cooperation Agreement. Finally, a recent report from the Manila Times warned that if U.S. bases were to return, this could provoke a Chinese attack. In that case, World War III will possibly erupt this time. If you like this video, smash that thumbs up and hit the subscribe button to get the latest news about military update and trend around the globe.